Kampala Entebbe Expressway is a four-lane toll highway in the central region of Uganda that links Entebbe International Airport, the country's largest airport, to Kampala. The multi-billion project, whose construction commenced on 21st November 2012, has been in phases and was opened to public use on 15th June 2018. Whereas the public commended government and Ministry of Works and Transport for the good services on the Kampala Entebbe Expressway, one of the biggest concerns was the darkness on the 21-kilometer stretch, especially at night. With a remarkable 96% of the Kampala Entebbe Expressway now brilliantly illuminated, Uganda National Roads Authority is extending its efforts to light up the Northern Bypass and Kampala flyover. The spokesperson of UNRWA, Alan Sempewa, highlights the ongoing initiatives to enhance and maintain roads, emphasizing the commitment to building a safer and more efficient transportation infrastructure for Uganda. Yes, we're going to light the Kampala Northern Bypass. Yeah, from the start up to the end at Namboli. In fact, the exercise has commenced. They're doing excavations along the road, so the road is going to be lit. We hope that it will improve. Uh, the, the safety of the road. Because one of the reasons our, our, our Ugandans are raising is the road is not safe. Uh, there are saturated threats because there are no lights. So we're going to put the lights and uh, curb uh, these cases of uh, theft and insecurity on our, on our highways. We're also going to light the Munyonyo Kajansi Spa. And I think you know that's also the main route for the NAM summit. Uh, excavations are also underway already. We hope that by 10th of this month, we'll have a number of sections along that road lead. He assured the public that the authority master plan is to improve and maintain roads across the country, creating a safer and more efficient transportation infrastructure for Uganda. So right from Mpala, airport road, Mpala, Kajansi to Munyonyo. We are currently undertaking beautification activities from the airport uh, road all through to Mpala. We are replacing the damaged guardrails uh, from Kajansi to, to Munyonyo. We are lighting that section. Alan Sempewa highlights the challenges and some of the successes of using the toll road. So these are not government of Uganda's roads. These are roads done by government of Uganda for the people of Uganda. So let's own them, protect them, guard them jealously. If you see anybody taking a unit or asset off our highway or expressway, report. If you've seen it anywhere, in any space or location, let us know and let's build and conserve these roads together. Brian Tumwinebiaruhanga. UBC News.